Don't make long-term decisions based on short-term circumstances. And I think that your ability to communicate to your staff, to your assistants, to your administration, I don't think it's ever been more important. I, I think the communication relative to being a steward has to be at an all-time high. And I think the communication to your administration has to be at an all-time high. Uh, I want our program to have the highest standards and the deepest care. Uh, and that's not just our standards on the floor or in the classroom, but everywhere. But I want our program to also exhibit the deepest care, the highest level of care possible. And that's not just the kid, that's a single parent mother. That's also uh, the kids that have moms and dads. And I wanna use ball to help transform their life. And I think with all that has gone on in all of our lives, everyone's emotions are frayed. And so the emotional fatigue that has come from all of this, I think it's hard to be the steward that we probably thought we were uh, five years ago or two years ago. And so I think don't make long-term decisions based on short-term circumstances. And I think relative to steward, it's create your own matrix for success. Because uh, too, many times we all want to win. We're all trying to figure out ways to win. Uh, I'm not negating the importance of winning, but instead of focusing or spending time on the result of winning, I think we have to determine what the matrix is in your program as the steward for winning. And whatever that process is, uh, what are those steps involved in winning relative to you being the steward for those below you and also for those above you?